I just realized why my vassal limit was going up with uh, Randomize, uh, Countess Ulak, and the Duchess of Dehobarth. Uh, I just realized the reason why that's happening <laughs> is because I had boats raised up here in this county, probably from all of them from the last war, and I never disbanded them. Oops. Totally forgot about that. Um, though... Who are you a Countess of? You are... Oh, no. Because I just realized that he's married to her. Which means... This dude... Is... Oh, wait, no. Huh? How? Ah. Oh, ho. Okay, never mind. That's gonna be fine. This is the kid who's going to inherit this county. Okay, so that should be okay. Keep this in Ireland. Because, I mean, the, the only other way to do it... Because I don't want this to become a part of De Hobarth. That's just going to make things really complicated later. Oh, Jesus. This is... <laughs> uh, the political situation in Ireland and Wales at the moment is not exactly simple. I, The fact that these counties are all just counties is becoming kind of problematic. I mean, I just made this a duchy, which should help keep things in order. I really should turn all of these into duchies. You're 37. Uh, not you. It will not be you. Uh, you would really like, the, like it if I did that for you, but you are the marshal of... Why are you the heir? Are you the husband? No, you're not the husband. You're Oh no, you're her you're her kid. Okay. You're just her firstborn son. That's not a problem. I could probably make you the duchess and have it be handed down to your kid. I mean, you really like me? Hmm. I don't know, but you know what I'm going to do? I am going to create the least at least going to create the duchy of Meath. Boom. I'm going to at least do this just to make sure this doesn't have inheritance problems. And you, sir, you're actually of my dynasty, too. I'm going to make you the Duke. You shall be the Duke of Mead. The Duke of Mead, I like that. 100? Excellent. Granted a duchy. That's done. So, how many troops would you be able to raise me? Only 500? Why that few? Oops, looking at the... Ah! Looking at the wrong one. Really? That's it? Oh, fine. Whatever. We're actually almost at 20,000 soldiers. Which is really nice. I mean, I'm gonna have to wait until these guys like me more. Um, randomize and Ulak. Uh, new hunting bird has been arised. Uh, a new hunting bird has arrived. What is has been arised? I don't I don't know. Uh, Prince Actium will like me more. He'll hate me more. Or I'll get prestige. I mean, you're just a baron. It doesn't really how much you like me. Plus, you're pretty old. You know, what? I'll take the prestige. <laughs> Sorry, Actium, but uh, not important enough for me to worry about. I gotta figure out what to do with Galicia. This is this is just a, a ticking time bomb until I do something. Oh boy. I mean, it's going to. How long does it take for the vassal thing? I think it takes like forty or sixty days or something for you to lose a point. I really wish I had noticed those ships were up before. Uh, my son is honest, you are not an heir to anything, and you're betrothed to someone. Who, who is this? Oh, uh, the daughter to the King of Scotland. Um, hmm. Quietly encourage you, I mean, humble wouldn't be bad. You know, I'll make you humble. Why not? A uh, son was born to my steward and, oh, my daughter, or my sister. 
and my sister. Okay, well, uh, a son was born. We'll have another Aaron. I need I need to really start naming these these kids. Five titles can be created. We can get rid of that. Same with the title loss. I know. I'm not really looking forward to it. Uh, oh, I've become a paragon of virtue. I'm another King Yon the Just. <laughs> not bad. I'm a hunter and a poet. But I have no... Oh, my wife is pregnant. Oh, no, my wife is pregnant. <laughs> Please let it be a daughter. I don't need another son. It's just... Oh, it's just gonna get so much more complicated. Maybe I should change my focus. My learning? Mmm. I mean, hunting is helping my martial and my health. You know what? I'm gonna give myself a carousing focus. Boost my diplomacy up by a lot. Maybe that'll help me claim this. Invite to go carousing. Preparing a small feast. Nah, you know, I won't do it with you. It's not gonna make much sense. You know what I will do? I'll do it with you. I'll invite to go carousing with you. This is this is a special thing you can do if you have the carousing focus. Um hopefully. He might not come because he, he's not too keen of me. I could give him money and he'll make sure he comes, but no. I'll prepare a small feast. Oh, he is going to come. Cool. Plus 10 for one year. Alright. Why not? Uh... My aunt... <laughs> Feels I risk too much, but it's such a thrill! I love that event. And my daughter... Is diligent! Cool. That's nice. Minus 20. Once that gets low enough, I'll, I'll, I'll think of going to war. Ah, my, um... Ah, my daughter has had a... Uh, has had a daughter. Cool. Uh, you are... Lygak, that's... No. No. Eh, eh. We'll have a... A new Elena. Shadow and Elena. I'm, I'm wondering, why the hell am I not being told my own kid is having kids? He had a son, and I'm, I, I either just missed it or it never told me. But one thing I do need to do is... What, what year would it be... December of this year, I think. Right? Or, oh, next year. Or September, sorry. A son was born... Oh, to me. Nuts. Named... Oh, they named him Welkin. Yeah, sure. We'll have another Welkin. My youngest son, Welkin. Oh, boy. The family lines are getting complicated. Ooh, the Teutonic Orders. The Order of the Brothers of the German House of St. Mary in Jerusalem has been formed, sponsored by the Catholic Church and the Holy Roman Emperor. The Teutonic Order, much like the Knights of St. John and the Knights Templar, primarily protect and care for pilgrims in the Holy Land, but will serve any Catholic ruler willing to pay for their upkeep. Being a religious order, they will only fight against heretics and infidels. Helfen werden heilen! Oh, we have another Holy Order we can call on, which actually we might be doing, because... If we go to war with any of the Muslim states down over here, we're gonna have to use probably holy orders to fight them. It's the most convenient thing. We'll have to pay for their upkeep in gold, but I can hire them with piety. Uh, alright. Let's start the carousing. Woot carousing. Uh, I'm just telling them I'm busy. Take the prestige. These days of revelry are an excellent escape. So many laughs and so many intense conversations in such short a time. It brings you closer to companions and you feel like good friends already. Oh, cool. We're close friends. Oh. Ooh. That might have just really helped me. You hate me. But he's your heir. Oh, 
if only I could kill you. Why don't I have a valid plot anymore? Oh, because that's already my plot. Oh, God, that could end horribly. It's over for now. Time to get back to real life. Gain 20 prestige. I'll have a point of diplomacy until... Oh, until the end of the game? Really? That gives me an extra point of diplomacy? Huh. Alright then, that's... Interesting. That is very interesting. Uh, but he is now my friend! Prince Nuno is my friend. Oh, this... Mmm... I really want to revoke this duchy now. What's a revoke reason if we have a truce? He is my friend, which means he actually probably wouldn't even mind me revoking that... Ooh, he probably would not even mind me revoking the duchy. He would not dislike me any more for it. Plus, if I give it to him, he'll love me even more. My niece needs an educator. Let's set you up with somebody. Um, Not with you. Uh, we'll set you up with Flan. Minus 16, the Teutonic Order. Ooh. In an effort to defend Suomi against pagan attacks, King Sampo has granted the Teutonic Order the County of Ladoga. Heathens, this noble gesture could help protect the endangered hunting. Really? That's up here. Holy crap, the Teutonic Order have a province. Well, they have a base of operations now. Huh. That's interesting. I mean, yeah, that, that's actually not a de jure part of the kingdom anyway. It's... They just granted them the county that they had left over. Feels like everyone is trying to trump me. Um... My huntsman killed more prey than I. Okay. If they are better than me, then I have to accept that. I can gain the kind trait. Do I already have it? No, I don't. Or I can gain envious. Hey, I, <laughs> I gained the kind trait. That will make people really like me. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, that's, that's good. Wow, that was a stroke of good fortune. Uh, let's use this money to upgrade something. Real quick. Um, how about over here? Let's get, get a training grounds going. And... This castle. Uh, let's boost up the castle town so we get more money. Maybe even something here. Uh... Hmm. Everything's kind of expensive. Might hold off on that. They're upgrading the temple shipyard. And the city shipyard. Cool, thanks, guys. Let's... I don't know what to do with this. Um, you're now known as a just... Arms for your wars. What war are you in? What? You're in a, a rebel war? Well, okay. That's kind of odd. I don't know what to make of that. Uh, let's upgrade. Well, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, we have a lot of tech points. We should use some of it. Yeah, we have over 700 over here. We're doing very well in the technology. I will not, I will not deny that. Let's see. Uh... Majesty might be nice. Tolerance might also be good. You know what? Now that we have Galicia, let's go for tolerance over there in culture. And for economy. Let's go for... Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's go for the improved keeps. That sounds good to me. 
Uh, oh, I need to place you somewhere. I just realized. Collect taxes. Because we get plenty of technology points. Charitable little rascal. Yes, you shall be charitable. And ooh, 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 ooh. Now that I think about it. Um, are you... And you're being educated. You're six. You must have just turned six. Okay, you know what? Uh, I'm going to have to drop the education of my son. Or, well, actually change who educates you. My daughter shall educate you. No problem. And I shall educate my grandson. Just so I can have control over how he turns out to. Oh boy, we gotta make sure we gotta make sure the line, the family line stays um, intact over here. Good. Do you dislike me for that? Yeah, you do, but it doesn't matter. Too cynical for age. No, you will not be cynical. Oh, we might have a revolt on our hands. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, that's not good. That is really not good. Hopefully they don't revolt. That would suck. Oh, that would suck a lot. Oh, good. That's going down pretty, pretty well. Uh, very well. Let them in. Oh, my grandson. Talk to him about kindness. I don't think he became kind. The Hindustan, the Hindustan myths. Fine. A uh, soldier named Azam will appear. Works for me. I would really like to get a goddamn claim on this place before I die. What? How old am I? I'm 44. I've got about 10 years before I need to seriously start thinking of dying. But I do still have a truce with you, I think, for the time being. Right? Don't I have a truce? Yes, we have a truce. But when does the truce end? Truce with, truce with King Pedro of Leon. It doesn't tell me when the truce ends. When did we incorporate Portugal? Or Galicia, I should say. Oh no, it was because it was with you that we... Ugh. I'm confused. Hopefully that... Oh! You only got a claim on the county. Well, I mean, that's better than nothing. I can't revoke the duchy. But I can revoke the county. Ooh. But if she declares war on us... If she declares war on us, this could screw her over royally. We could then take away the duchy from her with no problem. We could imprison her. This might just be our ticket. If she declares war on us, or, I mean, even if we just take the county from her, I mean, that'll, that'll be good enough as is, but... I mean, because I still need to revoke the duchy from her at some point, too. I really hope she declares war. I really, really hope she declares war. Find out next time what the hell Duchess Sancho does next time on Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. See you guys next video.